Hey guys, it's Mandy. Um, it's been a while, and oh, there's my cat. I was like, what was that? Um, it's been a while for me to make a video, but I just got in the fall soap box. So, um, as usual, you get this super fancy card, and it has all their stuff has a new logo on it, which is really exciting. I love the new logo. Um, everything's listed on here, so I will use that. So I have little descriptions for you. Um, something a little different this time. We normally get emailed our $10 codes, but this time um, they come in the box. And as it says, don't lose it because they will not replace it. So put this in a safe spot. Oh, God, my throat's so dry. Um, <clears throat> okay, so they normally come with something cute in it. Um, the summer one was a seashell. The spring one. I don't remember what the spring thing was. Oh, crap. Okay, well... The summer one had a seashell in it, and for some reason I can't remember what was in the spring one. Oh, it was a flower. Okay. And then this time we got little fall leaves, which are really cute. Um, so the first thing is, focus please, Snickerdoodle Whipped Cream. Um, you are always, you've always wanted to smell like a delicious concoction of cinnamon, butter, sugar, cookie, and allspice, right? And it's a really pretty, like beige, I don't know, it's like an orangey tan color, I'd say. Let's see. Focus. Oh, well. To me, it smells like a maple. Um, almost like a pecan pie sugar cookie mix, which I love right now. This is great. It's, per it's like the, the best type of fall bakery scent you can get. Um, sugary, mapley, buttery goodness. I mean, I wouldn't say, well, I'm a liar because I smell cinnamon too. So it very well may be snickerdoodle. Oh, I've never eaten a snickerdoodle. I know what they are. They're like sugar cookies with cinnamon on them, but I've never eaten one. What the hell is in my hair? All right. Um, and they have new containers. They're smooth. They're not like rigidy this time, which is kind of cool. I like them. All right, uh, moving right along. What are you? You're not what I want. Um, a milk bath in something and nutty. And this is, we couldn't decide on just one yummy fragrance. So we threw in all the things we wanted most to smell like for fall. A mouthwatering blend of vanilla, hazelnut, maple syrup, banana, coconut, lime, orange, grapefruit, bergamot, and clove. Oh wow. My, my my nose needs a minute. There's a really strong scent in there. I can't figure out what it is. Like what's what is that predominant scent? It might be the milk that I smell. Like the, the milk powder. I think that's what I'm smelling. That's throwing me off. I definitely smell the bergamot. I smell the hazelnut. It's like, there's so many scents. Like, you really have to, like, take it. You know, once you start smelling it, you start getting them all. It's really nice, though. <clears throat> and again, it has a new little symbol on it, which I'm loving. Okay. Uh, ripe for the picking, OCD. And this is like a really pretty purple color, which is quite nice. Um, close your eyes and imagine walking down the aisles of a local farmer's market on a Saturday morning with a basket over your arm. Yeah, that. Mm-hmm. It's floral. Oh, I wish there was like a description of what's in here. I'm sure there will be on the website. It's floral and it's sweet, like there's a uh, fruit in it. Oh, I smell like foliage in it. This. Okay, this is a sweeter version of the Hunter Green from the um, the Hunger Games collection. This is exactly what it is. It's like the Hunter Green, but with like fruit added. I love it. And <clears throat> normally I don't like the OCD. Okay, I'm not going to say that because I love the OCDs. I normally don't like smelling the OCDs right out of the bottle. Oh, hello. 
Oh no, these are the hard to squeeze bottles again. All right, I can't, I can't get it out because the bottles are too hard to squeeze, but some shot out when I opened it. But yeah, I don't like the alcohol smell, but this doesn't smell like that. And I really like it a lot. Okay, moving right along. Uh, we're already five minutes into it. I'm done freaking three things. Pumpkin crunch, po 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 pumpkin coconut crunch itty bitty gritty lip scrub. Okay, so too cute. I bought the pumpkin coconut crunch um, from the Christmas in July in the whipped cream, and it's one of my favorite smells I've ever smelled my entire life. And this smells more pumpkin-y than that. Well, there's some spice in it. It says, what could possibly make pumpkin better than just pumpkin? You guessed it, coconut. And you can see the little granules of sugar. And it's the perfect um, blend um, of sugar because it's not too harsh on your lips. It's actually pretty nice. Um, and it's so much nicer than dipping your fingers in like a pot. And I just think that's grody. So that's why I never bought it before from other people. <laughs> Oops. Uh-oh. I think it's... You can see the sugar all over my lips. I think it's a little melty from being in the car. Um, because I picked it up, the post office screwed it up and like sent it like seven different places. So, get all the extra sugar off my lips. Sugar lips. Okay. Um, so that's really good. I love this. Um, the next is <clears throat> a roll. Oh, hey, hey. Well, maybe I'll show you the side that's not. Anyway. It's a roll in the leaves fast busy. And it's a beautiful leaf in like this gorgeous, like, um, orangish, brownish, reddish color. And it says, prepare your nose for a roll in the leaves. It'll never be the same again. I like this. It's spicy, but like mildly so. Like, I feel like this is a very harvesty scent. Like, it's like what you would imagine being on like a hayride at like a pumpkin patch. This is what that reminds me of. Mm, I like this. I might use that tonight. Okay. Um, oh, this is like, remember when Shannon posted that thing on Facebook and she's like, what do you guys think this is? And we were all like, um, a blowtorch and blah, blah, blah. Totally was a blowtorch. I wish the sun didn't hate me because you can see like the brown little, <laughs> stupid sun. All right, let's see if we can, oh, let's do that. Okay, do you see, like, the little brown toasting on it? Um, boop. Okay. Mmm. An ooey, gooey smell of campfire roasted marshmallows. Oh, I'm going to smell this all day. I want this in everything. Everything. I really hope, Shannon, that there's um, a shampoo bar in this. Because I will purchase it. As an early birthday, well... Not in early, but my birthday is in like two weeks. So I'll purchase it as a birthday present to myself. I just ripped some of it off because I want to just keep it in the air forever. <sighs> okay. Um, roast my marshmallow. If you didn't get caught, did you really do it? Ah, uh, I want to. Okay. Um, second to last thing. I know there's a ton of stuff in here this time. What is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Love it. How excited are we right now? Are you super excited? Like, there's so many things in here they've never put in um, the, uh, the soap boxes before. Even though this is only like the third one. Eco Sud samples. This is seriously enough. I've got like the Eco whatever HE washing machine front loader thingy. And I use their laundry soap. Um, okay. This little bag is going to be enough for me to do two or three, four maybe, four or five loads. I don't know. It'll be quite a few. It's called Figs and Berries, which is really cute. Um, and it's a blend of figs, currants, cranberries, 
acai berries and raspberries. Now, <clears throat> it's hard to get like a true scent when you're smelling these because um, you get like that laundry detergent smell, but it smells really good. So I'll be adding this to my, I have got the non-scented and I have the loopy, I'm sorry, the in the loop. So I'm going to add that to it. Last but not least, but, 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 last but not least, Cram your face in my sweet pumpkin pie mask. I'm pretty sure if I didn't bring this fragrance back from last year, there'd be a revolt. It smells like a pumpkin cupcake. So this is the face mask, which makes me uber excited because I've never tried the face mask. And I need something great for my skin because I have really bad skin. Um, so this is basically you add your own activator. Um, you can add... They have different things. If you have dry skin, they suggest you use water, cream, milk avocado, banana, honey. Um, if you have oily skin, you should use apple cider, vinegar, sour cream, yogurt, green tea. Um, if you have acne skin, yogurt, milk, honey, green or black tea. So this is pretty cool. Um, I might use this with some milk and some honey and some water later. Um, I'm actually going to, there's no might about it. So I should probably smell it, huh? I don't know how it'll smell since it's like the face mask. Mm. It smells really good. It doesn't smell like a face mask at all. Um, make sure that's sealed. So yeah, um, if you guys don't know about the soapbox, which I'm sure you do by now, unless you've been living under a rock, um, you pay 20 bucks uh, four times a year. You get one every holiday. And I mean every season and if you think about it $20 is nothing when you get some full-size products this is full-size this is full-size I think this might be one of their smaller full sizes um, this is definitely a full-size bath fizzy you know what I mean so you're getting full-size products that you're gonna end up spending like you know triple uh, you know uh, and you figure out the difference, whatever 8 divided by 20 is. Plus, you get a $10 gift card, so you're basically getting it all for $10. Plus, you're not paying for shipping, which I'm assuming they're paying at least 4 or $5 for shipping. So, you're basically paying $5 for a whole box of full-size and sample-size products that are amazing. And you cannot get this type of quality or these amazing smells anywhere else. So, I highly recommend you go to fortunecookiesoap.com. I will put the link down there and um sign up for the winter one when it comes out also there's gonna be a halloween one so i think she's limiting that there's gonna be a very limited number of those so hop on that bus and look check out your email subscribe to the newsletter if you don't have it already okay i love you bye